hello friends welcome back to our kitchen to our new subscribers my name is Yvette Simwa and today we're making a delicious stir fry eggplant we are I've added some seasoning some green bell peppers and some soy mints and we'll go straight ahead to our ingredients which are our main ingredient is eggplants so we have one big one and a small one we'll have to chop them we have green bell paper you can use red or yellow bell papers we have one um, relatively large onion two cloves of garlic we have a quarter cup of cassava flour but we'll not use all of it um, we'll use it to coat the eggplants here we have textured vegetable protein or soya mints we have hydrated them by adding hot water here we have cumin we have a pinch of cayenne that's optional we have himalayan salt and here we have rosemary you can use oregano instead here we have blackstrap molasses um this recipe called for soy sauce but i cannot access that for now so i decided to try with blackstrap molasses here in our bowl we have water with lemon juice and Himalayan salt we'll use this to uh, to add our eggplants after cutting so that they don't brown because eggplants brown quickly so we'll use that and we have some more water here that will aid in our cooking so we'll begin by making our vegetables cleaning them once more and dicing them and slicing the ones that need to be sliced as you can see here um our eggplants i've never seen this i just saw and tried and i'm happy that they've not browned and um this is what you really want i have poured the excess water and allowed it to sit for like five minutes so right now i have poured a little bit of cassava flour i hope to make this crunchy by adding the cassava flour so we'll see how this will come out so add slowly as you mix gradually so that it can form a thick coating um, so I did that I did not use the whole cassava flour I can say I used like two tablespoons and so in my sophuria I added um, one tablespoon of oil and some water here I am stir frying my onions and garlic until they be translucent as you can see here now I've added my soy mints I ought to have added my eggplants initially um, but it still did work so you can try my method or you can begin by the eggplants you see how the outcome will be um, I've added my seasonings I just stirred for a minute or so adding my seasonings and the salt mix so that the seasonings can mix well with the food with the soy mints and the onions and the garlic um, soy mints takes a short time to cook so once you here add your eggplants and maintain a high heat we would like the eggplants to be crispy on the outside um, for some time so I kept stirring like this for um, like four minutes just that's just an estimate um, until I saw the eggplants starting to brown a little not to burn but to brown a sign of um, cooking because of the cassava which you had coated the eggplants with so when they had begun browning after some time I left them to cook on low heat for two minutes I did not show that but I allowed them to cook for two minutes and while it was cooking I was making a mixture of the blackstrap molasses and some water which I am now pouring so I took the blackstrap molasses and 
added some water and stirred and as you can see um, the food is changing color to the color of blackstrap molasses and this is just what I really needed to see something that resembles the cover of the eggplants and something that will mimic the soy sauce which I I saw was required in the recipe which I borrowed so here I'm adding my green bell peppers you can decide to dice them I decided to slice them and I did not want them to cook very much to become mushy so I was content with this way so for a total of 10 minutes it has been a matter of stirring and here we go the eggplants have cooked before you remove them from the fire you can use a fork to insert and see if they have cooked and as you can see for us here it is cooked well it is looking beautiful we've garnished with some coriander and sesame seeds and the aroma is just a blessing um, the taste is very beautiful if you like this recipe please give it a thumbs up and remember when you're eating this eat this to the glory of God this food was full of deliciousness and it requires temperance um, for more videos plant-based nutritious hit the subscribe button and the notification bell bye